Game two of the Eastern Conference Final between the Pittsburgh Penguins and Ottawa Senators. And what did I think about that game overall? Well, I thought it was very chippy for the most part between the two teams. There was a lot of physicality that were thrown throughout. And in the first period, they lost both Brian Russ and Justin Schultz. That would be the Pittsburgh Penguins, excuse me. But that was kind of what came to mind first was the physicality in, in, the, in the game. And hopefully that carries on through the series because you got to love physical playoff hockey. It's really entertaining. A lot of people weren't entertained with how Ottawa played overall, though, because they seemed to turtle a bit playing in a 1-3-1 or a 1-4 for most of the game from what I saw. So a lot of people weren't happy with that. There was an interesting stat that said the Senators' first shot in the third period came with 4.54 left, and then their previous shot before that came in 3.47 left in the second period, which is really crazy if you think about it. Other than that, I thought both goalies were really good in the game, even though Marc-Andre Fleury wasn't tested too much. Craig Anderson was good in the game, and uh, Marc-Andre Fleury got his 10th career shutout, which ties him with Henrik Lundqvist for the most among active goalies. Also, I thought the Penguins' defensive core, short of man, were really good, especially Brian Dumoulin. I think that's what really took me of, of intrigue from the Penguins' perspective. It was really good defensively throughout, and it really took away a lot of Ottawa's opportunities, even though there weren't many for Ottawa in the game overall. What did you think about Game 2? Leave it in the comments below. Like and subscribe if you'd like more content like this. And Game 3 is Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern in Ottawa on NBCSN and CBC.